A U.S.-funded project using satellites to track and publish water levels at Chinese dams on the Mekong River was launched on Monday, adding to the superpower's rivalry in Southeast Asia. The 4,350 kilometers, 2,700 mile, waterway known as the Lansang in China and flowing south through Myanmar, Laos, Thailand, Cambodia and Vietnam has become a focus of competition. Beijing has dismissed U.S. research saying Chinese dams have retained water to the detriment of downstream nations, where 60 million people depend on the river for fishing and farming. The Mekong Dam Monitor, part funded by the U.S. State Department, uses data from cloud-piercing satellites to track levels of dams in China and other countries. The information will be open for everyone in near real time. A separate indicator of surface wetness is to show which parts of the region are wetter or drier than usual, a guide to how much natural flows are being affected by the dams. The monitor provides evidence that China's 11 mainstream dams are sophisticatedly orchestrated and operated in a way to maximize the production of hydropower for sale to China's eastern provinces with zero consideration given to downstream impacts, said Brian Eiler of the Washington-based Stimson Center a global think tank which operates the virtual water gauges. The two nations are also at odds in the South China Sea, which Vietnam calls the East Sea, where Washington challenges Beijing's claim to most of the waterway, a major conduit for trade that is also rich in energy resources.